This is my GU Patrol and my rear wagon drawers and bed setup. Come closer. Here we've got a double mattress that's from Bark Rubber. This will comfortably fit me. I'm over six foot and another person quite comfortably in here. Uh, able to shut all the doors and sleep inside the back. With this mattress on top, two front seats get folded forward and this mattress covers the second and third row of seats so you can sleep in the back when you're out camping. He also converts so that it doesn't have this in there all the time. You take the mattress out. And then this sits as a regular set of four-wheel drive drawers. Just has six of these, uh, these milk crate sort of boxes that we can put all your recovery gear and all that sort of stuff in. Six of these, three on this side, three on this side. And on the left side, remove this piece another storage box to put your toolbox and all that sort of thing in. So on the sides here we've got the storage storage area you can put your toolbox and that sort of thing in. Skinny area on the side here for all your hoses and recovery gear uh, and we've also retained the factory side pockets that are factory with the GU Patrol. When you're done using the, uh, using the back area and you want to use the seats again the third row of seats is entirely gone but the second row of seats remains so I'm just gonna get my dad to give me a hand over here and we'll demonstrate how to change it from two seats to five seats. So first off, start by getting the front seats, moving them all the way forward and tilting them. This gives you enough space. My legs dangle, dangle over the front, of the, um, front of the bed a little bit, but it's still quite comfortable to sleep in. Move those two seats forward. Lift this piece off, freeze up. It's just got a over center holder on the back lift up and knock the legs out of the way. See the legs underneath there, it's alright. So these legs fold up out the way, then fold it down again, tip it up on its edge, and this card comes all the way out. I've just put a bit of cardboard, uh, cardboard box on the top of the seats to protect them. You can flip up both the seats and use these exactly as they're normally used. Everything here is retained as it is, and I've just put the headrests from the rear seats under the front seats. They fit under there quite nicely. Also important to note that the way the, uh, the front board's designed for your bed, the second row of seats can be entirely removed so you can use the second row area where the seats were. All this entirely removed so it becomes storage underneath your board.